Hello, hello, my name is Zeep. You're watching Zeep Nation, and today we're playing Shotgun Witch. It looks wholesome. Um, as wholesome as a witch with a shotgun can be. Demons have taken away your spell book during your slumber. Without it, you no longer can continue your journey to master all spell casting. Our heroine now laid bare. The only possessions she has left are the clothes on her back and her top of the line 12 gauge double barrel Remington for only $109.95 at S Mart. Nobody touches your spell book. Uh, WASD to move, shift or space to dash. Cool. Use E on the ultra to begin. Left mouse button to shoot. Right mouse button, use wide shot. Interesting. Wave one. Okay, so my bullets also... It's an instant kill. Okay. So my bullets also seem to mitigate other people's bullets. So that's good to know. Seems like my bullets are an instant kill too, though. I think. It's hard to tell for sure. I think so. At least for right... No, that one was definitely at least two tap. Oop, oop, oop. I don't think there's any way to, um, upgrade the weapon, though, unfortunately. Wave two. Okay, so it's for each wave I have to press it again. This is good to know. I do have limited range though on the bullets. Unfortunately. There does seem to be a pretty easy pattern, um, but when they stack up like that, I mean, even the easy patterns can get a little overwhelming, understandably so. Let's see wave three. Did it say how many waves there are? I want to say 10. 10 seems like a good number. Okay, so we're back on wave three then.
would be nice if there was like some sort of like um upgrade system i mean i totally understand there not being one it's a pretty uh simple game i want to say it was made for a game jam now that i say it out loud The enemy spawn pattern also seems to be randomized as well. Um, because I mean, this is the second time playing with Wave 4. And they're definitely spawning in a different order. Or I'm just going crazy. I mean, both are very possible here. Or maybe the spawn is just based off of um, where you left off. That could very well be the case too. Incoming, all right. I mean, what's stopping us from just safe spotting this guy? I feel like I had time. Okay, so we just start out wave five. Okay. Oop. Oop. See, like, I had a countdown for that one. I mean, boss is right, like, it's supposed to be more challenging. But, like, for game mechanics, you know, it's like... The, the boss doesn't teach you game mechanics. The boss is an implementation of game mechanics, right? So, like, if you're gonna, like, introduce, like, an area of effect damage, like... Hey, this is an area of effect. Area of effect attack. You have like an entire second to evade. The boss shouldn't out the gate only give you like half a second. I mean, like, very personal take. I mean, everyone's right in their own regard, sure. But like, that area of effect right there is training you for what to expect for the boss battle. Um, I mean, I still like the game, don't get me wrong. It's an obnoxious game. But it's very cute. It's nice. It's Halloween. We do this for... Remember... the reason for the season. I'm just losing it today. All right, here.
Ah. Right here? No, you're up here now. Yeah, I mean, maybe just the spawn locations are random. Just enough to, like, keep you on your toes, you know? Time? No. Right, 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 right. Just need to watch out for that area of effect, I think. The smaller guys don't seem to be doing that much. Oh. Congratulations! You got your spell book back. The day was saved and you put your 12 gauge Walnut stock, cobalt steel, with hair trigger double barrel Remington, and the little uh, uh, and the title of shotgun witch away. Okay, um, that was that was shotgun witch. Um, the title has changed to regular witch. If I just do a new game. Yeah, no. It just redoes the game. Well, yeah. That was Shotgun Witch. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and happy spooky season, everyone. Have a good one.